Stevie J has suddenly gone off the radar, and people are starting to take notice, especially now that his friend Diddy has been arrested. The chatter is getting louder, with many questioning whether Stevie J's absence is just a coincidence, or if he's trying to distance himself from the fallout of his connection to Diddy. With Diddy behind bars, the feds are now turning their attention to those in his inner circle, and Stevie J seems to be on their radar too. At Pira Vida by my pad, run into the man right here. Uh, what's up? Miami's like that. Yeah. It's a movie. Diddy is now facing a slew of serious charges, and things are looking grim for the music mogul. What started as quiet whispers has snowballed into a full-blown scandal, with federal charges looming. Many believe this is just the tip of the iceberg, with more accusations and stories involving high-profile names tied to him likely to surface. But it's not just Diddy under fire. His entire circle, including artists and industry insiders, are feeling the heat. Several former bad boy artists are being dragged into the chaos, with old grievances resurfacing and new legal issues emerging. Diddy's once powerful empire appears to be on shaky ground, and at the heart of it is Stevie J. Stevie J and Diddy go way back, especially during their time at Bad Boy Records, where Stevie was a key producer behind some of the label's biggest hits of the 90s. Their relationship has always been more than just business, with rumors over the years suggesting their bond went deeper than music. Recently, Rodney Jones, a former associate of Diddy made explosive claims about Stevie J and Diddy's relationship. He alleged that Stevie and Diddy were secretly involved for years, keeping their relationship under wraps. These revelations are now tied to the scandals surrounding Diddy's infamous parties, revealing that Stevie was more deeply involved in Diddy's personal life than many assumed. Rodney's lawsuit paints Stevie J as a significant figure in Diddy's wild lifestyle, with those notorious parties now under federal investigation. With Diddy facing serious charges related to these events, it's no surprise Stevie might be feeling the pressure. If federal investigators dig deeper, Stevie could find himself entangled in this growing mess. And he likely knows it. Guys, let's talk about Stevie J. Love is hip hop. What's going on? Uh, I'm just reading from page 14 of the file. It says, Mr. Combs uh, used access to Stevie J and his knowledge of Mr. Jones' admiration of Stevie J to groom and entice Mr. Jones into engaging in. It says Mr. Combs went as far as to share videos of Stevie J, uh, another man with. This is some crazy allegations, guy. And this was done to ease Mr. Jones' anxiety concerning. Like, what is going on? So it, look, looking at this story, guys, Mr. Combs promised to make sure Mr. Jones would win producer of the year at the Grammys if he engaged in home. That lets you know, guys, something is in the milk is not clean, guys. Something in the milk ain't clean. So as we continue on here, it says the following screenshots are videos of Stevie J, a Caucasian male. Look into it. If you've been paying attention, you'll notice that Rod's lawsuit doesn't just focus on Diddy. It also names Stevie J as part of an alleged scheme to exploit young artists. The lawsuit accuses Diddy of using Stevie's influence to lure up-and-coming talent into questionable situations, with Stevie often acting as the middleman without fully understanding how manipulative things were. One of the most shocking claims in Rod's lawsuit is that Stevie may have been unknowingly filmed during some of these compromising moments. It's no secret that Diddy was known for secretly recording people at his infamous parties, and Stevie wasn't exempt from that behavior. If those recordings surface, they could become key evidence in the growing federal case against Diddy, potentially pulling Stevie further into the mess. The idea of being unknowingly caught on tape in such vulnerable situations would terrify anyone, which might explain why Stevie has been keeping a low profile lately. With Diddy's empire falling apart, Stevie could be the next to face serious consequences. Rumors surrounding Stevie J's sudden disappearance are gaining traction, and as more details come to light, it's becoming clear that his connection to Diddy is far more dangerous than it seemed. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
So, Diddy got arrested, and naturally, 50 Cent wasted no time trolling and taking jabs at Stevie J. 50 has been going hard, posting memes and throwing accusations, making it seem like Stevie is deeply entangled in Diddy's mess. But in a twist, Stevie's fan base isn't staying silent. They've been clapping back on social media, denying any connection between Stevie and Diddy's business, claiming these rumors are just attempts to drag him down. Some are even accusing 50 of trying to tear down successful black men, saying his trolling is part of a larger effort to divide the black community. However, Stevie's fans may not be helping his situation. A lot of people think their defense is only making him look more suspicious rather than calming things down. Social media is buzzing with debates, and many are questioning why Stevie's PR team seems so shaken. Could there be some truth to what 50 Cent is saying? Is Stevie hiding something? We're likely to get answers soon, but for now, it's becoming clear that Stevie could be next on the Fed's radar. With Diddy's situation growing messier by the day, legal experts predict Stevie's name might pop up in the investigation. It's not uncommon for those involved to turn on each other when the stakes are this high. And with Diddy facing serious charges, the pressure on his crew to cooperate is mounting. Stevie's name keeps surfacing, and if it's revealed that he played any role in Diddy's alleged activities, he could be in serious trouble. Rumors are even circulating that Stevie J might already be under federal investigation due to his ties to Diddy. While his fans continue to insist on his innocence, it's hard to dismiss the possibility, especially in light of Rodney Jones's allegations. I'm here to say that I've never seen my man doing anything foul like they talking about. None of it, all of it, I, I mean, you know. I, I've never seen it. I've known him for 29 years. And then it's like with guys like like 50, you know what I'm saying? Like Uncle Tom cast like that. You know what I'm saying? It's like you now you want to put me. I don't know if y'all saw the post where 50 posted about me. Of course you guys see yes, it. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I mean, 50 um, has been going after Diddy and everybody associated with him for months now, ever since the Cassie lawsuit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, you can't brush under the rug. I, I don't see anybody um, um, reporting about what um, tatted up Holly said about him beating her up and about, you know what I'm saying, his other baby mom saying beating her up. I just look at it as, you know, he wants to bring the black community down worse than anyone else. How How is that so? I said what I said on my post and I'm standing on that. Fans are lighting up social media with theories about Stevie J's involvement in Diddy's downfall. Some are convinced that Stevie played a bigger role than anyone imagined, pointing to his long history with Diddy as evidence. One popular theory floating around is that Stevie was a major player at Diddy's infamous parties, allegedly helping to arrange the guest lists for those controversial gatherings. According to this theory, Stevie wasn't just a bystander. He was just as responsible for the illegal activities as Diddy himself. Fans believe that his fear of getting caught might be the reason he's been laying low, trying to clear his name before the feds come knocking. The big question now is, what's next for Stevie J? Is he just another victim of Diddy's crumbling empire? Or is he already planning his exit from the chaos? With all the rumors swirling, Stevie's future is looking bleak. He's out there denying any involvement, insisting that 50 Cent and others are just trying to tear him down. But we all know how federal investigations work. They rarely focus on just one person. If Diddy's situation continues to escalate, it's likely more of his associates will find themselves under the microscope and Stevie's name keeps coming up. Stevie and Diddy go way back, with deep personal and professional ties, making it hard to believe he can completely separate himself from the fallout. With Rodney Jones's previous allegations still making headlines and new claims of manipulation surfacing, Stevie might not be able to dodge the storm headed his way. If Diddy goes down, Stevie could easily be next. However, 
let's not forget that Stevie's been through this industry long enough to know how to survive controversy. He might just be keeping a low profile, hoping things blow over. This isn't the first time his name has been linked to drama, and he's always managed to bounce back. But what do you guys think? Will Stevie J get dragged down with Diddy, or will he find a way to avoid the feds? Drop your thoughts in the comments, and stay tuned for our next video, where we'll explore which other artists might be caught up in Diddy's legal web.